Hi everyone, my name is Anna Yancy and today is finally moving day! I am finally here! Oh, I got my ID! Got my ID! It is super, super hot. So I finally got my keys and I am walking to my dorm. It's just that things got a little confusing this year because of the whole pandemic. Us RAs are coming from out of state. We are required to move in the 29th because we need to do our two week quarantine before the rest of the residents start coming in. And that's why there's no one too because it's only like a very minimum amount of people that are moving in today. I'm literally like, <sighs> Oh, my RD just sent me a snapchat and she was like welcome home Let me know if you need anything or if there are any issues with your room. Oh, I don't know if you guys can see it But she's so cute. Okay, so we're gonna start bringing everything down and there's a lot of stuff And it sucks because they're not providing any cards and any or anything like that to help us bring stuff up because of the whole pandemic So we're gonna have to carry everything by ourselves yeah! Jesus we just started and it's already a mess so I don't know how we're gonna do this guys. I brought a lot of suitcases. I didn't bring a lot of stuff like last year. I learned my lesson. So my mom's there. Dio la ma. Hola. Now this is what I'm taking with the pillow. And uh, wow, everything just seems so dead. Last year, like all the sororities were here. Like it was so fun. And now, nope. <laughs> Doesn't seem like moving day. This is gonna be harder than I thought, honestly. And it's just so hot. Otra que? Otra cambiadera. Y las que faltan. Ni siquiera me traje todo, eh? <sighs> Feels good to be home. Okay, so I'm trying to get the key. Yay! Gosh, I can already tell I'm gonna struggle with this key. Wow! So I've already been in this room, but it's still really exciting because it's now my room. Oh, that's cute. We're here. Oh my god, it's just too hot guys. I cannot like this is intense. I mean, I probably should put my hair up, huh? First things first, I'm going to put my key with my ID because knowing myself, I'm probably going to lose it. Uh oh. being such a mess and then I have this tiny little keychain that keeps breaking on me I don't know how I'm gonna set up my room honestly my bed is just like that right now but I'm supposed to be getting two beds to make it a king size but I don't know what's going on but honestly I don't mind I'm okay with the twin Yay! but it sucks that I'm gonna be on my own but anyways oh my god my parents are calling me I have to go help I don't want to go out to the Sun anymore but I guess I have to <laughs> my glasses okay let's go this is the restroom this is the shower here this is the toilet and this is the mirror so i have my own restroom so this whole theme right here which is actually pretty big a big mirror which outfit of the day by the way but i'm dying because pants do not go well with this heat okay so i still have all of this i just brought them like this because i did not feel like folding them and I have all my blankets and stuff down here as well. Okay, one more time. Ready? One, two. Oh, it hurts my arm. It's honestly really boring. It's nothing compared to last year. The elevator just closed on me. Oh, it opened. I pretty much had the same size of a room last year, but I had a roommate. I did say that like I honestly preferred to have a roommate. I can't start doing anything because my mom and I are going to literally disinfect the entire room. Ahorita estamos tratando de desinfectar todo y aquí mi mami haciendo todo el trabajo fuerte. I love you, mom. Yo le había dicho a mi jefa que iba a llegar a las 3. Y ahí va súper, súper tarde. Viene llegando aquí a las 4. ¿Eh? Pero llegaste. Por eso le estuve dando carrilla y se me enojaron porque le estuve dando carrilla. Ya, vete entiendo la cama. Si tiende la primera, lo ya para ir limpiando yo aquí. Sí, señora. 
El refri lo ponemos. No traigo tele ni micro y traigo un refri chiquito. Vamos por mi padre. I always get scared that people are going to be in the elevator when I'm coming in and I'm with the camera and I'm like embarrassing. No la colgué porque pensé que los ah, iba. I was supposed to get a king size bed and <laughs> yep. So change of blankets. <laughs> yes, eh? Okay, so this is pretty much what we have so far. There's a lot of stuff for my dad too, but this is mostly for me. But um, change of plans. I changed my color. So I was gonna have it yellow and gray, but I just decided to keep it pink and gray because I love pink. And I don't know, I just pretty much have everything pink, so I might as well just stay with pink. So we're back from Walmart, and we bought pretty much everything that I needed to be here for at least two weeks without leaving. So this is how it looks so far. It's nowhere near done, but I'll finish that right now. The restroom, we just added those things, but of course I have to put a lot of more stuff. Okay. Mamá, que me lavo el baño. She hates me. I have to take my The one that me So, my parents are leaving. Okay, so I high key locked my keys already in the room. And I had to open the window. Um, thankfully, it was open, so I didn't have to call anyone else. But I am going to get the bag of food that they told us we were gonna get. So, I got my bag of food. And I'm just gonna go say bye to my parents because they're leaving me already. And honestly guys, I want to cry. I want to cry so bad, you guys have no idea. It's definitely hitting me way more than last year. Last year, because I knew I was going to go home every weekend, so it wasn't as hard. But now it's like, I don't know when I'm going to go home. Mira, ya se está comiendo mi, mi poca comida que tengo. Bye, hija. Eh? Bye, mamá. Diosito te cuide. Igual. Bye, papito. Ay, voy a llorar. All right, so I am by myself now. My parents just left, and it was really emotional. I started crying, and I've been crying for the past like two days. It makes me nervous and it makes me anxious because um, I'm by myself. Like I don't have Hannah to like laugh with, to room with, and it sucks, you know? It also makes me emotional because my birthday is on Saturday, August 1st. I'm gonna have to be quarantined. Yeah, it hurts a lot because um, it's the first birthday without my family and just by myself, you know, and I don't want to cry. I know that it's gonna be worth it because I am thankful that I get this opportunity to work as an RA and to be here. It's okay, I'm just very emotional. Okay, so the lighting in here is so bad, but I'm still going to finish a couple stuff. I am planning to move that right here. Honestly, it might all change for my dorm tour, which will come later. But once I am able to leave and go get more stuff, that's when I'll be able to fully decorate my room because I'm still missing a lot of stuff. I'm extremely weak, so I probably should have asked my parents to help me with this, you know, but I'm already here. So I'm going to try to do it by myself. I still have to do a lot of stuff, as you guys can see. It does not look cute right now, so please don't judge. Putting these up right now. Trash. <sighs> one done. Okay, so one thing is up. Now I have to figure out the rest. Change of plans. I'm thinking of moving that one over there and moving the one that's over there over here. better because 
because it doesn't look too too big this is actually heavy jesus <laughs> Don't really like it, but that will do for right now. Not eaten all day, all day. So I'm just waiting for this to dry real quick. Oh, it has a thing. I'm so stupid. But yeah, guys, I am pretty much done for today. I only need to do the things like on the wall, but I'm lazy and I am tired and I'm just done for today, you know? Uh, but yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for my dorm tour video. It was not as interesting as last year's, but due to the whole pandemic stuff, it just didn't happen, you know? So I'm just happy and I'm thankful that I get to be here another year because I love where I live. Like this is literally home to me. I'm excited to see how my life as an RA is going to look like because being a resident was definitely a crazy experience. And yeah guys, it's already like one in the morning. So I'm ready to go to sleep and wake up late tomorrow because I'm exhausted. But um, yeah guys, uh, I hope you liked this video and I know it was very different, but um, that's literally how it went for me. But I am still very excited and I am ready to see what this year is gonna bring for me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media. They'll be right down here. Thank you so much once again, and don't forget to just be you, do you, and for you. Thank you guys. Bye.